How many calories you should eat daily to lose weight based on actual science? If you think about it seriously, you will know that losing weight is not completely complicated or even too hard if you know what to do. No, this is true, based on science. No matter how much you weigh, you can lose weight every week if you consume less calories than you burn. In this video, we are going to share with you scientific-based fact about calories and how many you should eat daily to lose weight. Watch the entire video to learn more about your situation. Your height and age play a part, so make sure to watch, listen, and learn. How can I lose weight? This is one of the most frequently asked questions by millions of people daily all over the world. For various reasons, a lot of people want to shed pounds, but only a few succeed. Many people try to achieve their weight loss goals through good old exercise and just generally being active. On the other hand, others tend to look for other methods to help them achieve the same results with lesser effort. With weight loss programs always in high demand, a lot of fads and alternative weight loss methods have come to light. Individuals can lose weight through various methods, from going on a diet to undergoing a liposuction procedure. But on top of dieting, there are several possible ways to control your food intake. Some follow the ketogenic method, wherein the body is trained to burn fat for energy efficiently. Others turn to more drastic measures like water fasting. But the most commonsensical diet is to consume fewer calories than you burn per day. The only way to do that is to find out how many calories you should eat daily to lose weight and then count the calories of all the food you consume. Counting how many calories you should eat daily to lose weight is an effective method based on actual science. Although there have already been several formulas developed for this, the Mifflin St. Gior formula published by the American Journal of Clinical Nutrition in 1990 is the one that's generally accepted as the most reliable. A comparative study published by the Journal of the American Diabetic Association in 2005 definitively demonstrates its superiority over previous formulae. To use the Mifflin St. Gior formula to compute how many calories your body uses per day, you'll first need to determine three things. 1. Your weight in kilograms. 2. Your height in centimeters. And 3. Your age in years. For males, use the following formula. 10 times your weight in kilograms plus 6.25 times your height in centimeters minus 5 times your age in years plus 5. So, a 30-year-old male who is 180 centimeters tall, 5 foot 11, and weighs 81.65 kilograms, 180 pounds, will burn about 1,796.50 calories throughout the day. That's his basal metabolic rate, BMR, or the number of calories he will need to maintain his weight. But if he wanted to lose weight, he should consume fewer calories. 500 calories fewer, or 1,296.50, would be ideal for a healthy weight loss diet. For females, the formula is slightly different. 10 times your weight in kilograms plus 6.25 times your height in centimeters minus 5 times your age in years minus 161. So, a 25-year-old female who is 165 centimeters tall, 5 foot 5, and weighs 58.96 kilograms, 130 pounds, will burn about 1,334.85 calories throughout the day. That's her BMR, or the number of calories she will need to maintain her weight. To lose weight, she would need to consume only 834.85 per day. If you are still confused about how many calories you should eat daily to lose weight, you can go online and search for calorie calculators. Such tools will compute the number of calories you should use as a daily limit. There are a lot of sites to choose from, so make sure to compare the results from several websites and calculate the average suggested calorie intake. 
for those who have the time and resources. You can also contact your local nutritionist and ask for advice or a diet plan to help you lose weight by calorie counting. Here are study references we use to create this video. Thank you for watching. If you like the video, please share with your friends. And please subscribe to our channel if you haven't already done so. If you want to be notified of our new uploads, do the following. New subscribers, click on the bell icon when you subscribe. Old subscribers, please turn on all your notifications.